everyone now let us discuss about mock questions from coding concepts for cpt exam coming to the first question in cpt coding concepts the first question is cpt codes 228402 228428 are modifier 62 exempt and the options are true or false and the correct answer is true if you go in the cpt book for 228402 228428 they are spinal instrumentation codes and the insertion of spinal instrumentation is reported separately and in addition to orthodesis and the instrumentation procedure codes 228402228428 and also 228532 228854 and 228859 are reported in addition to the definitive procedure and under it you can find the note do not append 62 modify 62 modifier to spinal instrumentation codes in the book itself we can find the statement do not append modifier 62 to spinal instrumentation codes that come under the range 228402 228848 and modifier 62 is indicated for indicating two surgeons it is appended to indicate two surgeons and these code ranges are exempted from 62 modifier Coming to next question, an ABN must be signed when? The options are A, once the insurance company has denied payment. Option B is before the service or procedure is provided to the patient. Option C is after services are rendered but before the claim is filed. And option D indicates once the denied claim has been appealed at the highest level. And the correct answer is option B. an abn must be signed before the service or procedure is provided to the patient first of all what is abn abn is nothing but advance beneficiary note abn indicates advance beneficiary note a medicare patient must obtain an abn before receiving any item or service that the provider believes original medicare will not pay for because of the medical need or lack of non coverage so abn must be signed before the service or procedure is provided to the patient next question is wound exploration codes include the following services what all services the wound exploration codes include option a is exploration and repair option b indicates exploration including enlargement removal of foreign bodies repair option c indicates exploration including enlargement repair and necessary grafting option d indicates exploration including enlargement debridement removal of foreign body minor vessel ligation and repair option d is the correct answer wound exploration codes include exploration including enlargement debridement removal of foreign bodies minor vessel ligation and repair Next question the full description of CPT code 24925 24925 indicates amputation arm through humerus secondary closure or scar revision option C is the complete description of 24925 it is nothing but amputation arm through humerus secondary closure or scar revision Next question medical necessity means what option a is without treatment the patient will suffer permanent disability or death option b indicates the service requires medical treatment option c indicates the condition of the patient justifies the service provided option d indicates care provider met quality standards medical necessity in the term itself necessity is there necessity is nothing but justification so medical necessity means the condition of the patient justifies the service provided option c is the correct answer the condition of the patient justifies the service provided coming to next question the following which of the following statements is false option a is external cause codes external causes of morbidity codes are in the range B zero one two by ninety nine. Option B is you may assign as many external cause codes as necessary. Option C is external cause codes are only used in the initial encounter. And option D is 
external cost codes can never be a principal diagnosis. In the following, external cost codes are only used in the initial encounter is the false statement and rest of all the statements are true. So option C is the correct answer. External cost codes are only used in the initial encounters. Coming to next question, which of the following codes allows for the use of modifier 51? In the CPT book, there is a symbol indicating modifier 51 exempt. If you see here, this symbol indicates modifier 51 exempt and this symbol is present before For some codes. And those codes will not allow 51 modifier. That is, wherever you find the symbol, that code should not be appended with 51 modifier. And the question here is, which of the following codes allows the use of 51 modifier? If you see in the CPT book, code 20975, code 93616 and code 93600, before all these codes, you can find this symbol. That is modifier 51 exempt. So in the given options, option D 45392 allows the use of 51 modifier. So option D is the correct answer. 45392 allows the use of 51 modifier. And 51 modifier is mainly used to indicate multiple procedures. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe for further videos on medical coding and CPC training.